here we are, Matt. Look, we're in the metaverse together. Yeah, it's pretty exciting, isn't it? This is actually a space we can simply drop into. Sweet jacket, by the way. Thank you. Virtual fashion is important. So this is kind of like a hangout space? Yeah, that's right. Just like Nicole mentioned, we envision people gathering here for those serendipitous aha moments. To have a space to interact, come in, brainstorm, or even just catch up on what's happening in life. That's important. There were so many times at the office where the best ideas came from those conversations in the hallway or by the water cooler. It really is true. I also like to come here and relax sometimes. Look outside, it's so peaceful. And you know what? Just like in Teams chats, any work that we would do here can be seen by others. So if we would come back tomorrow, the work is still here. If others jump in the room later in the day and they want to pick up where we left off, it's very easy for them to do that. I'm really starting to see what you mean by migrating physical experiences into virtual environments. Totally. In fact, we actually have more traditional conference rooms in here too. You want to go check one out? Of course. This is quite the space. Is this the conference room? Pretty cool, right? I can feel it. It feels like I'm in a meeting, but what else happens here aside from, you know, chit-chatting? Well, it really all depends on your organizational needs. Up on the screen, you can see the presentation I was just sharing to a few clients. Other times, you may want a different style table that everyone can gather around. For example, to review a 3D design of the fall line of apparel, or maybe the architecture of a new building being designed. Regardless of the room configuration, the important thing is we can now bring anyone in the world together to experience a meeting in these immersive spaces while feeling like they're present together. And with the productivity tools you're already well familiar with, right? Absolutely right. This is too cool. I can already envision organizations benefiting from using these spaces to bring teams and partners, clients together. So thanks for showing this to us. Should we go back now? Well, hang on a second. I'd love to take you into one more immersive space, something that's designed more for a company connecting with your customers externally. Shall we check it out? Yes. Matt, this is incredible. Where are we? We're here at the World Economic Forum's Metaverse. It was created in partnership between Accenture and Microsoft. You can see the town hall over to my left, and a bit further back behind me, you can see the Trillion Trees Project. Amazing. Wait, Trillion Trees Project? What's that about? <laughs> Great question. Really, beyond organizational use cases, Metaverse experiences can unlock entirely new ways for companies to connect with an audience anywhere in the world. Why don't we go into the Trillion Trees portal and I'll quickly show you. Here we are. Are we in a forest? Wait, I see a desert as well. That's right. Trillion Trees is designed to empower users with the ability to learn about important topics like reforestation. It's just one example, but virtual worlds like this can really inspire people to take action in the physical world through these immersive virtual ones. I love it. The types of environments and experiences you've taken me through today are so impressive. You're blowing my mind. But we're running low on time, so let's get back to the studio. I'm ready. Let's go do it. That really was an incredible experience. And I honestly, seriously, I really get it now. I don't think I did before, but I do. Thank you so much for being my guide. Yeah, for sure thing. It was my pleasure.